very special thing to have all your guys fighting on the same card. Obviously, we're a bit of a, a superpower, if you like, in this part of the world. If teams out there get a chance to put three, four, five guys on, do it. Because you'll never get a feeling like that in a gym ever. It's very unique. Woo! We, for the most part, have the same crew that's been around us for years. So if there's new people that kind of pop in, you've got to go through some horrific physical feat to gain your acceptance. Which one's leading off? Which got all this testosterone in the room, you've got 30 other guys watching, you cannot be the one that gives up. Go! Go Monty! Go Monty! Go Monty! Go We're not looking for you to win, we're only looking for you to not give up, because that's what the sport's about. Yeah, we just wake up and uh, had a coffee, enjoy this beautiful view and the beach, played a bit of uh, touch football down at the beach and uh, put his energy in the right places. Yeah, I think, uh, you know, Ty's been through the trenches and he's had the hard days, he's had the long nights, he's had the sacrifice of not going and partying and doing something that he loves. So um, here we are this week and we're ready to roll. The work's done. It's probably one of the best I've seen him this week. Is his aura has been good around camp. He's laughing and having fun and he's got his family and friends around him, so it's good. Ah, oh, hello guys. Oh, have a seat, huh? How do you intend to win it? Like, what is ideal for you? Yeah, I gotta bring him to a place that he doesn't want to be. I gotta get close, I gotta make it a war, and I just gotta start chipping away, chipping away, and maybe it's a TKO, or maybe I win the third, fourth, and fifth. Did you do anything differently in sparring to try to adapt to that mindset? Like, you know, with, with Alex, it was hard, man. It was like, you're gonna get a title fight if you win this. Big, scary kickboxer, you know, it's like, there's a lot of pressure, a lot, a lot of pressure that I think I let get to my head. And mind you, and it could be the same thing as yeah, go out there and get knocked out first round. I'm like, oh, give me my check, I'm going home. But uh, yeah, it's just go in there and fight. Just turn it off and fight, you know, don't overthink it. You know, it's like, you gotta believe in your cardio, gotta believe in your ability, but no, there's any way you cut it, it's a hard fight. It's a hard fight. Is that all sure, done. guys? Sweet. Yeah, it was the engaged store in Sydney. We had some people out in the front at 6 a.m. this morning lining up, so yeah, it's uh, pretty crazy. What brings you out here today? Just want to meet Izzy, bro. Real big fan. Izzy, bro, the king, the goat. Izzy by submission. Let's go. I'm back again. Yeah, yeah. That's right. See, so remember these. I remember these. Check it out. Boom, the OG. It's always good to do these kind of activations during fight week or any time we can when the guys are in town. Um, give back to the fans and you know, I think it builds him up and, and, and pumps him up as well. I think he vibes off the energy and he's, a big, he's all about energy and I think he leaves with um, you know, a really big smile on his face and, and really appreciates the love. I know, everyone says that. Until they get in the octagon with me. Like, oh, he's so fast. I can't touch him. Where is he? Now he's over here. Man. We just came out there, met the best in the world. Nothing else, nothing more. That's the gem. There's none more, none less. Number one. Have a good day, bro. Thank you. It's a real crocodile hat. It's real leather, though. Yeah, man, I'm going to a press conference to advocate for a, a better, bigger PETA presence in, uh, in Australia. <laughs> Sean Dundee. Oh, yeah, let's go, dude. I gotta represent you guys a little bit, man. Kiss me, please. Can you take picture? Yeah, I got you. <laughs> it's a hat, right? Thank it's you. a hat. Thank you so much.
<laughs> yeah, my girl got it for me. <laughs> UFC 293 press conference in beautiful Sydney, Australia. Gonna be famous for a day. We brought a stacked card for our first show in Sydney since 2017. Up first to the stage, he's willing to fight any place, any time. Sean Strickland. about it this energy is absolutely crazy in here today thank y'all for coming out israel this card has been built around you and i'm curious how does it feel that you brought this back to sydney i don't think i did i think we did australia new zealand in the house i don't think it's just me i think we did this yesterday you said that sean strickland was dangerous where does he present you dangerous in the cage he is a dangerous man because he has nothing to lose and everything to gain let's go sean you have a chance to win the world title this weekend, but I wonder how much more it would mean to take it off someone that people consider one of the greatest of all time. He's a bad I'm up for it. You guys motivate me. It's gonna be awesome to bring the belt back to the States. We'll have a good war. It'll be fun. Ty, is this victory gonna be one of the greatest moments of your career, in your opinion? Sydney! Yes, I. I'm gonna come in and try and take uh, Volkov's head off, just like he will be doing mine. For sure, it will be a really good show for everybody of you. Tyson Pedro and also Ty Tuivasa. How much does it mean for you to represent your people here this weekend? This is the best thing ever, man. Hey, lad. Sean, what makes you believe uh, you can shock the world against Israel? I'm ready to give what it needs to give. Because not only do I represent America, but I represent you guys. I represent you I always use my platform to talk for you guys. What I don't do is I don't use my platform to sell out and make money. When I walk into that cage, you guys, you guys fuel me, man. I want to go in there and I want to win that belt for you guys. And I want to bring some pride back to the middleweight division. Israel, I'm curious, how does your dislike for Sean compare to the likes of Costa and Vittori? I don't really dislike him. He's just annoying, that's all. I'm gonna knock this oh, around. Yeah. That's all I give a about. Can't thank y'all enough for the energy. We're gonna stare these fighters down. Very cool.